Hello guys, welcome back to NFT Inspo. For today's video, we are going to show you how to fix DNS error Shopify. So if you're interested, let's start a tutorial. Now in this case, there are going to be a few things that you could do here to probably solve this issue. So one of those things is we need to first check if you've properly set up your domain in your Shopify store. Now typically at the bottom left, you should see settings. Go ahead and click on it. And from here, look for the option that says domains. Now in this case, in this section, you should be able to start editing your domains and make sure it's actually properly set up and make sure that it's actually pointing to the correct IP address. Now, another thing that you could do here to uh, probably fix this issue is sometimes the issue itself is in your browser. So sometimes clearing your cache on your browser can help a lot. So in this case, go ahead and open up your browser here. Click on the three dotted icon here and you want to go to your settings. Now, by the way, I'm using Google Chrome here. So if you're using a different browser, the steps for you to actually clear your browser might be different for you. In this case, choose the option here that says privacy and security. From here, click the option that says clear browsing data. And you could either select the cookies and other side data, cache images and files here and the site settings here. You could go ahead and select that. And if you want to also include your browsing history, because sometimes that also affects uh, your store here, you could go ahead and just click on clear data. Now, once you've cleared your data, try accessing your store here. Now, the reason for this is sometimes uh, if you have a lot of data on your browser, that could actually impact your store, especially if you're changing your domain. Now, in this case, um, another thing that you could do here is you need to check your Shopify account. In this case, go to your settings here. And from here, make sure that you're in the billing section and make sure that you've actually paid or you don't have any uh, uh, subscriptions that are pending. So make sure that everything is paid in your account. Now, in this case, once you've done that, see if that actually solves your issue or if you once you've solved your payment or the pending payments in your account, once you resolve that, see if that solves the issue. Now, if this doesn't work, uh, the next thing that you could do here is you need to check all the recent applications that you installed. Because sometimes if you sold a uh, recent application or if you've recently installed an application in your store, sometimes that they will actually affect your store and would actually interfere with your DNS or you might receive any pro or problem, some problems on your DNS. Now, if that's the case, I would recommend you to visit the last app that you actually installed and try uninstalling them and see if that solves your issue. Now, most likely if uh, uninstalling the app actually solves the issue then most likely the issue itself is with the app so it might have some features that actually contradicts with your website here so in this case you might need to look for an alternative for you to actually uh, use now if that doesn't solve your issue then the best thing or the next best thing that you do here is try contacting support so typically at the top right you could go and click on your store name here and from here, you could go ahead and click on the option that says Help Center. And usually at the right side here, you should see the high, uh, virtual help center assistant here. You could just type in here, I need assistance with an agent. And from then, they would actually give you an option to contact uh, Shopify support. But in this case, they would actually in help you solve this problem. So it might take a while, but in this case, that's about it. So hopefully this video was able to help you. Like and subscribe to NFT Inspo. Thank you for watching.